I was young. I saw these men standing on the corner and they just had wads of money. And I knew I, that's what I wanted. I started a, a disgusting lifestyle of pimping girls and selling dope. I ended up in jail. I was in there on Mother's Day. And it was one of the worst days of my life. I just wanted my children back, but obviously not bad enough. I got out of jail, and my eight-year-old, Gabrielle Marie, she said to me one day, she said, Mommy, please don't ever leave me ever again. Even that didn't stop, though. I went right back home. I had a full-time live-in nanny for them. Who would do that to their children? Both of my ex-husbands had, had filed for custody of my kids. And I was reaching out for anyone to help me. Anybody. I just wanted someone to help me. And then one morning, I got a text message. I said, can I please give you a call? God used her in a mighty way. God used her in a mighty way. She opened up her house to me. I just don't understand how people do those things. I don't understand it. And she brought me to church. I just didn't believe that anyone could forgive me for all of that. They loved me when I didn't love myself. And as I surrendered to Christ, God used the generosity of other people to show me his love and mercy. And I was so thankful. And I know beyond a shadow of a doubt in my mind that following Jesus Christ is worth the risk in every way, shape, or form. Changed my life forever. Changed my heart forever. And I want to do nothing without God for the rest of my life. Every single second of every single day. Amen.